This coaching video is aimed at the intermediate and advanced subsurfer looking to draw better lines in order to go faster and do better turns. We're going to discuss top to bottom surfing. At first glance, the surfer here looks good. They appear to generate speed down the line, identify targets, and throw down a couple turns. Let's go back to the beginning. Because of the trajectory the surfer draws, they're actually a bit stuck in the wave face and forcing each move. This has to do with the line they draw. What we want is to maximize the speed the wave gives us to then maximize our power and flow. We do that with more top to bottom surfing. So let's compare the line he draws to a more top to bottom line. All right, here we're at the beginning. So I'll first in red illustrate the line that the surfer draws. Essentially mid wave face most of the time a little speed and then back at the top a couple times till the wave finishes out. Compared to more top to bottom, maximize our speed, minimizing our effort, dropping straight in, leveraging the entire face of the wave, maximum speed, bottom turn up to the top, staying in the critical section to then re-enter. The shape of our surfing line is a lot more U-shaped, more top to bottom. So let's watch them again and I'll try to follow along with our green U line. Here we'd be dropping in deep to the bottom coming back up into the critical section. You notice it's a little more slowy, a little more flowy, a little more patient style surfing. So here we've got Mofredis, one of our favorite subsurfers, illustrating some top to bottom flow. Notice how he's staying in the power section all the way through. Okay, so to wrap it up, let's take a look again at both examples. As he's surfing now, you can see how the line could be surfed a little differently, resulting in more speed and less effort. And then Mo, doing what he does, top to bottom, getting it done. Hope you guys enjoyed this Subsurf coaching video. Now get out there and shred.